It's been so long since my last commentary. The last one that was in the library was my FIFA 15 video. I mean, I've been busy, but it's been a long time. So let's correct that by releasing a video today on F1 2019. And we're in Australia in a blue and yellow car, which is a colour scheme I enjoy very much. And the lights are coming on. We've got four lights, five lights. Oh my god, that took ages. Afro Ninja and a mega jump start, but we're finally away, ploughing towards turn one. Is there going to be a crash? You know there is. It's absolutely huge. Into the barrier has crashed. The guy in front of me, oh, he ghosted. Someone was facing the wrong way off on the right there, but we have made it through pretty much unscathed. And that guy is going extremely slowly, so we're just going to overtake him straight away. Go up the inside of this car here. We're going to try and hook it round the outside. And he's kind of forced me out wide onto the curb. So nothing. Oh, but we've made contact. That's a disaster. Someone else will spun. He spun. Oh, my God. It's chaos. What is going on? It's still going on. Going into sector two. What was that? I've cut the corner to avoid someone else. But I haven't got a legal overtake for, for it. And, and, and bizarrely, we've come out having gained places. I'm in P5 now. I've actually gained out of all that. I've no idea how I've managed that, but I'm going to actually take it. As you may have, 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 have caught on by now, damage is off in this lobby, and thank God it is, because, well, there'd be no one left. There'd be absolutely no one left as we look to do the undercut on this VNT Rosenkiss dude, and, uh, well, we've done it, but he's... He's hanging it around the outside. I'm trying to leave him space. We're here to race fairly, you know, if we can. Although that's gone pretty much out the window, you know, within sector one of this race. He's gone a bit wide. That's going to harm his exit speed. And we're going to have him up the inside. But uh, he's still there. And there's two cars sniffing for any opportunities right behind me. I've done all right there. But there does see. Yeah, there's been a crash. There's been a crash. I have no idea if that was my fault, whether I accidentally pushed people. I registered no contact, so I'm just going to carry on for now in position four. Uh, but uh, it's not a safe position four. We've got Matt GW not far behind me at all. There are yellow flags. What's that for? Oh no! Involved in it! Has indeed been involved in a crash. And that has promoted me up to the podium now. Position three. Now, this was only my second race back on this game in months. I've barely been playing F1 2019, I'll be honest. So, uh, I'm extremely out of practice, nowhere near my peak level. But somehow, thanks to carnage of unrecognizable proportions, we've, we've managed to get ourselves on the podium. Now, we're absolutely nowhere near the okay, square in, in front of us and the guy in p1 is gone like he is gone he's just set a fastest lap uh and and he is just away oh no the square has set the fastest lap so fair play to him we're nowhere near we're just looking now to okay, hold on to this podium position if we can and we massively missed the braking zone there oh dear no matt has taken full advantage of our mistake there and and rightly so. That was that that was awful, awful driving on my part. That's that's the fact that I'm so far out of practice. I just forgot where the braking zone was. I mean, I, I got it all right on the first two laps, but uh, not that time. Oh no, Matt has gone wide, hit the grass, lost control, and after after they put it in some kind of accent after taking me on on turn one he didn't even make it to the end of the sector before relinquishing that position back to me and uh, well all I have to do now is keep myself ahead of involved in it and I will have garnered myself a podium position which after the trials and tribulations that uh, have encompassed this race would be a very respectable Result indeed. Uh, I think the race winner is about to cross the line. Yep, there we go. 
race winner is Fantastic Arm, closely followed by a man who claims he is a he is a square in real life. But we're going to come through in position three, having having taken full advantage of the of the pileups on. Oh my God, that's not gone very well for that guy, has it? Over the line. Oh, it's Matt again. But uh, having taken full advantage of the pileups on lap one. We have come home in position three. Um, yeah, into the barrier himself came fifth. Not a bad result. Who's left? That that guy's facing the wrong way. It's not gone well for him at all. Plenty of people. Oh, Square has left the session for some reason. Can't even be bothered to stay for the podium, which is a bit rude considering you know he's on it. I've no idea who that is. We're still waiting for people to cross the line. I just want to see the podium. I, I just want to see myself up on the podium my, in my beautiful blue and yellow car. But we're still waiting. Six hours later. There we go. Finally, it is confirmed third place for myself. And I've just noticed that the shade of blue in my helmet doesn't quite match the car. I might have to try and fix that but there I am with the British flag that is an interesting that's a Norwich City car there's no other way to put it and uh, there we go thank you very much for watching I really don't know how long it'll be to the next video could be months could be years could be next week I've, I've got no idea but either way thank you for watching this video and uh, check out my other channel, which is Metal Covers of Things. A few of them were on this channel. I've moved them to another channel. I'll be doing another one of them very soon. It's already recorded. So that's cool. And yeah. See you next time. Whenever that may be. Goodbye.